Hey guys. So today I wanted to make a video on all the stuff I got for my daughter's birthday party to kind of help anybody who has a baby that's turning one and they don't know what to do for their party or to if someone's having a similar theme birthday party. Um, but unfortunately, I have to kind of talk about this before um, I move on. So my daughter's party and birthday was on March 21st and we pushed that back because of the whole virus thing. It was meant to be for this weekend, which is April 4th, but now that is not happening. Uh, but anyway, I did buy quite a bit of stuff um, and I'll just show you guys. In case your guys' little one's birthday is later in the year and you guys can probably have the party and stuff, so I wanted to make this video anyway. So for the start of like the party decor, I guess, um, her theme was a garden theme just because she was born around the spring equinox. Her name is Lily, so I wanted it to be kind of garden springy themed, so that's what we did. Um, so I got, her main colors were like different color, different shades of pink, mainly like a dusty rose. And then lots of green and white um, for like the garden. So I got some streamers. It came in a two pack. Um, I got pink, white, and green. And all those were from the Dollar Tree. So my older sister bought a helium tank for my mom's birthday party. So I was going to borrow that and um, blow this up. I got a pink number one. Uh, and then I got these confetti first balloons there. I wanted to have confetti balloons because I thought they were really cool. And then for her cake, um, I got her cake number one candle that's really sparkly. It's open because on her actual birthday, I made her cupcakes and we used this. <laughs> so at least that didn't go to waste, I guess. So this is a handmade little sign that I got for her um, smash cake. And it's just a glittery little number one that um, you stick into the cake. And I got um, tablecloths. And I didn't know they came in a pack of three, but they did. And they're, they're just these. Um, they're little flowers. I guess you can only see like a corner here. They're ma mainly like that and then like around it it says one. Um, for her main decor, I got this kit. Um, they gave you like a whole like birthday kit. And it came really, really well packaged. Um, and I guess if you want to know the name. So in here they give you a um, happy birthday sign. The thing I like is I was able to find the dusty rose pink decor that I really wanted. Um, from these guys and then they have those little spiral things they are gold pink and silver you can kind of see the pink and then they have all different sizes of those little um puff balls so they give you um big and small ones and they even give you like a little instruction sheet on how to put those together and then they give you the just some more like little decor I wanted her to have more balloons and I looked at so many different party stores. I looked at Walmart, I looked at Target, and I couldn't find any um, balloons that I liked. So I went on Amazon and I ordered a really big pack of balloons. And yeah, this is a crap ton of balloons. And the cool thing about that is some of these, you can't tell on camera, but some of these have confetti in them. so. <laughs> I think I might just blow some of these up for her just so she can have fun with them. For her party guests, since it's a garden party, I wanted everyone to have flower crowns. So I ordered two packs of 10. I found them on Amazon as well. And they're pretty nice because they come in solid color and then some crowns have all the colors on them. So you could pick and choose. I only have one pack right now because of the gift bags that I made, which I will show you guys what I put in those in case you guys are curious because I personally was lost on <laughs> what to put in her gift bags, like her party favors. So I will show you guys an example of one of those because a lot of them, I decided to just make the party favor bags and just give them out. <laughs> 
anyway um, just so I can get that stuff out of my room because my room has been just cluttered with her birthday stuff so yeah um, this is what they look like um, you will see one out of its package and everything when I show you the party favors so yeah this is how they came I wanted to do a little backdrop behind her high chair so I bought this is big um, 90 foot vine um, I'm just gonna cut it up add some flowers to it and then just leave some as vine so that's that. and then I ordered some more vines but with white roses on them um, they came uh, they came as a two pack and they're already as a package because I used them for her first year pictures so that's how they look and they actually even have little hoops on the end for you to just be able to like tack them into the wall for her party i at first i thought i had everything and then i asked my boyfriend like what we were missing he's like you guys don't have any like you don't have any games or like activities um and i didn't know what to do because i knew it'd still be kind of cold outside but i figured what better way than to uh, let kids be creative so I got these little canvases at the Dollar Tree and they come in a two pack and they have all different sizes. We wanted to give them something a little bit bigger to um, paint on and then I just bought some little finger paint. So for her party decor, that is all I had. And now I will move on to the party favors. But sticking with the theme, I wanted them to be f very feeling like a, I wanted them to have a feel of like garden picking or like, apple picking or something like that. I went with a plain little brown bag because I thought of like garden and like when people go picking they usually have like brown baskets and stuff so I just went with a simple brown bag. I was really excited for the party favors honestly once I figured it out. So I got these little pots. They come in a four pack at the Dollar Tree and we just bought pack, um, bags of potting soil and I measured them out. Um, in here and then I dumped them into these little party bags and then I gave everybody the same flower because I didn't want everybody fighting over the type of flower that they planted um, tried, so I tried getting the most like neutral but nice flower um, so I got these and then I got them some pop rocks these sugar-free Hawaiian punch things that you can just throw into bottles of water um, and then I got they got ring pops and then lastly trying to stay springy and have activities uh, I got them bubbles this is one of them that is out of the package they have these little leaves that hang down which is really pretty and fun so yeah and the thing i like about these flower crowns is that the flowers are ad adjustable so that you don't have to deal with them staying in one spot and as you can see how they're held on but yeah um people might think i'm weird but i gave even the boys flower crowns um mainly just because i have so many <laughs> they can have them or their sisters can have them or their mom can have them whatever so all the boys got these, the variety color ones. This Saturday, the day her party was supposed to happen, me and my boyfriend are going to make her some cupcakes <laughs> again and decorate the house and kind of just have a party between the three of us just so one, all this stuff doesn't have to go to waste <laughs> and two, just so she does have somewhat of a party because I do feel insanely crappy that she didn't get one. I hope you guys liked this video. I hope it helped any of you guys that are kind of stuck on what to do for your kiddo's birthday, even if, if it's not a first birthday or if you're stuck on even just party favors and you want to know. Yeah, um, I hope this helped you guys. If you guys did like this video and if you're new, go ahead and click the subscribe button, um, like and comment, let me know how you guys liked the video <laughs> and go follow me on Instagram because I'm trying to be a lot more active on my youtube instagram so yeah and follow me on twitter because i tweet like all the time i don't tweet like crazy stuff but i that's the place where i just like brand ramble about the most like dumb things so definitely they're always in the description at the end of the video yeah um and i hope you guys are all staying safe staying home and staying healthy and i will talk to you guys later